I think it's part of growing up, pushing boundaries. Are they in danger? I don't think anything could have prepared me for this place. The people, their history, everything they've lived and who they are today. To hear him tell it, Amaru, Dominguez, Kukul Khan, only wants to keep Paititi safe. But I've seen the lengths he'll go to, the murder and cruelty. I have to stop him. Unaratu approached the throne through the crowd. She walked beside it, but did not sit. Why do we continue to believe this lie? She asked the crowd. Kukul Khan controls this city, and I will no longer wear a smile and pretend it is any different. I will not be his puppet, trotted out to wave and smile. The guards cut her off quickly and ushered her away. Then they advanced, with weapons drawn to disperse the crowds. Uhumilov. <tose> Pehmishvak, Kubeita Lupatal, Jetele Jantio, Hach Jabayo, Jan Kinekin Naitik in Putzul, Chen Kainchak, Humpel Cheme, Kashike Nichil, Leal Kafhao, Helen Betike, Baletulaka Linkustale, Weikuchil Jane, Min Hach Malo, Kain Hetzech Bayo, Minunach in Utsul, Tukultik Lailie, Nip Olal Ikil Awujiken, Bayin Wolukesab, Jab Alil in Tukule. I would love to. No, why? Why? 
Tu ya la capanac le chenó gelo. Ya lo yili cuyochel le quinmanac y chile cajó. Jumpel quine. Sholaj chignal jumpel le chenó cajó. Juntul callí. Hach cuchignal le ti. Y que el yuk bal lejao. Macbechal uyilik uyochelí. Le isha jawó. Tu yotak uchuk le cayó. Vale jal cajig. Luf y chile cheno casatig. Disappeared. Y chilu yuchul kashane. Kashantaf ya bach. Bejov y chile chenovo. Vale. Mishpikin kashantaf le ti. Kuyalale. Leish a jawó. La eliti yane. Tanu yilik. Uchukik le cayó. Thank you. That was quite the story. Villager claims to have seen a strange creature in the streets. They followed it to a walled-in alley where it disappeared. Citizen describes similar experience in Upper City. Woke to discover something trying to climb in a second-story window. When she yelled, it dropped the street and disappeared. We'll continue to monitor. Each Taka of the cult of Kukul Khan vows to tie his coat to that of Yutu, descendant of the Maya. Lacking any family of his own, each Taka will live with the parents of Yutu until such time that they have built their own home and hearth. Yutu vows to tie her coat to that of each Taka. She will bear him many children, which they will raise according to the traditions of both their peoples. We leave the city at first light, which is just as well, for a terrible disease has spread across it. Dead and dying line the paths and choke the streams. Many are saying it is punishment from the gods. Journal of Adelantado Perez. Twenty fourth of November, sixteen o three. I accompanied Andreas Lopez, a group of twelve soldiers and two molosses through the jungle. The directions the Jesuits provided to Trinity were excellent, so we discovered the hidden city with little difficulty. The natives of the city welcomed us warily, but we plied them with gifts, and they reluctantly allowed us to enter the city, unaware of our true intentions. Lopez has begun to search for the artifact while we distract the city's leaders.
That must be the temple I saw from the riverbanks. Batz and Hun Chowen were twin brothers, older half-siblings of the more celebrated Maya hero twins. Jealous of their brothers, the monkey twins would always cheat during football matches and ruin them with their aggressive tactics. In retaliation, the hero twins lured them up a tree, a tree which never stopped growing, preventing Hun Batz and Hun Chowen from getting down. The hero twins convinced them that they could use their belts to climb down, but this turned out to be another trick and the belts became tails, turning the elder twins into monkeys. Turn mirror one to the left. Follow the beam of light to mirror two. Direct mirror two across the chamber diagonally. Return to mirror one. These seem to be instructions of some kind, but I can't make out the rest. They must have arrived at the right time. It looks like the cultists were just here. All full up. Can't carry any more. Only the worthy may call upon Kinichahal. Use his light to chase the shadows from your hearts in the city itself. Amazing. This must be where they perform rituals honoring the sun. I don't have enough space for that.
each with a different marking. They're numbered. This is mirror one. Need to create a path to mirror three. I won't last long if I fall in the water. Need to create a path to mirror three. The divine canoe, which carries Maya souls through the underworld and into the sky, is directed by two gods. Old Stingray Paddler sits in the back of the canoe and handles the duties during the day, while old Jaguar Paddler sits in the front and takes care of the night shift. These two gods symbolize not only light and darkness, day and night, but also the interdependence of all equal and opposite forces. the way out. This is the way out.
Amazing. This must be where they perform rituals honoring the sun. Can't make it across. I'll have to backtrack. Need to create a path to Mirror 3. Need to create a path to Mirror 3.
need to create a path to Mirror 3. Need to create a path to Mirror 3.
Need to create a path to Mirror 3. Shark was a very important god to the Maya. He taught them farming secrets and oversaw growing and the harvest. Generally, he was associated with all forms of fertility. He was also in charge of wind, lightning, and rain, which was caused by his tears. He was in charge of preserving springs, wells, streams, cenotes, and other sources of water. Like the aspects over which he presided, he was considered benevolent and caring, but unpredictable. Physically, Shark was depicted as a reptile with hair tangled and unruly knots, and his colors were white, red, yellow, and black, representing north, east, south, and west. 